The county executive, who happens to be a volunteer firefighter, showed off his fire truck driving skills in Bergen's new mobile driving simulator. You could see by um, my not being behind the wheel very often how, uh, how I face some of the challenges that, uh, that are presented. The sim may be fun, but the driving is serious business. The $180,000 simulator is only the second mobile sim in the state. New Jersey Transit has the other. The goal is to get more local first responders behind the wheel here first without having to go to the non-mobile simulator in Mawa, which takes people out of work for the whole day. I was a former firefighter in my town. I used to drive a ladder truck. And when you first started, you'd go to a huge parking lot where you couldn't hit anything. This would be great to start on this and get a feel for those wide turns uh, before you get behind the wheel of one of those uh, fire trucks. The recent bus crash along Route 80 that killed a student and a teacher brought home how wrong driving decisions can cause catastrophes. The mobile simulator recreates driving in police cars, fire trucks, school buses, and dump trucks. This is the fire truck sim, and just like the real one, you put your seatbelt on, you don't talk to a camera next to you, you keep your eyes on the road, turn on the sirens and the key with the sim is that you could practice all you want in real world scenarios and if you wreck it all you have to do is push restart for new recruits the sim may be the first time they actually drive a large truck they may not be familiar with the weight of the truck and the feel the touch and feel of actually being behind the wheel of uh, you know a truck that's 40 or 50,000 pounds um, that's important because, you know, we're, sometimes we're getting people who have never driven anything more than their mother's Toyota. Uh, it's a big difference. Bergen County has been stocking up on high-tech gear for first responders. Two summers ago, the county got a fleet of drones that are now being used for search and rescue and law enforcement. The mobile sim can be used by any municipality in Bergen for free. In Hackensack, Andrew Schmertz, NJTV News.